Ahead of the Tokyo Olympic and Paralympic Games next year, we're seeing more diversity in the media. Now, opportunities are blossoming in the entertainment industry for people with disabilities. We look at an agency that's supporting this trend. NHK World's Yukari Kondo has more. In April, an audition was held in Tokyo's Ginza. Thirty-six finalists showed off their talents from singing to dancing. The budding performers all share one thing in common. They live with disabilities. And they've long been awaiting this moment. I'm now hoping to join the Tokyo Paralympics as a wheelchair fencing player, but I'd also like to be a model. I absolutely love dancing, but I'd given up on training and the challenge because of my appearance. The audition organizer is the publisher of a free magazine for disabled persons. Unlike its peers, Coco Life doesn't take up medical or welfare topics. Instead, it produces features on love, marriage, and fashion. Last March, the publisher launched another venture, Japan's first talent agency for people with disabilities. The move was inspired by corporate Japan's increasing demand for models of diversity in its ads. The agency's more than 30 registered artists and models are learning roles in various media. This short film is about people with SMA, a muscular disorder. The leading actress, who also has SMA, is represented by the agency. And this woman, too, was surprised by the agency. She's now the host of her own monthly radio show. Entertainment offers for disabled talent used to be niche. But now, it is becoming more mainstream in society. We started this agency because we are convinced that a movement toward diversity is underway. The agency is pegging Akiko Tomida, selected in an audition last year, to be its next musical attraction. She's been playing taiko drums since she was little. As a child, she was diagnosed with an incurable eye disease. Even after five surgeries, she lost vision in her left eye. Now she uses an ocular prosthetic. With her right eye condition worsening, she has been undergoing laser treatments and injections to reduce inflammation. She sometimes suffers from side effects. Yet Akiko is still pursuing her dream to be a professional percussionist. She visits Tokyo for lessons with the agency's music producer twice a month, traveling about three hours each way. <laughs> My life has changed 180 degrees since I joined this agency, and I discovered a new side of myself. She takes her practice seriously and learns fast. I would like to train her and see her play like other professional musicians, regardless of her condition.
ックライフタレント部の富田明子と申します。よろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。Through her agency, Akiko is now in talks with an IT firm to work on a new media project. At the end of the April audition, the agency's artists held performances. Akiko played a taiko and snare drum set. I am visually impaired. I lost my left eye last year, so I put in an artificial eye. I'll continue to perform at my best even if I lose my right eye. Coco Life Talent Agency is transforming the Japanese entertainment industry into an inclusive one where the public. We'll see more people with disabilities. We are concerned that the Paralympics could create only short term opportunities. So we're working hard to create a permanent movement. Yukari Kondo, NHK World, Tokyo.